So hello there, welcome to the Sky Food Channel. Today we change food for the Anterino Surocco. Now look, they are already, some of them are already in the third stage here. And I just, uh, some minutes ago, I put in some fresh leaves and as you can see, they wandered to the new leaves, straight to the flowers also to eat the flowers. Look here, they are sitting on this branch of Prunus Lauro Terrasus and see how they have grown, that's really beautiful and they leave a lot of fecal pellets so it's time to think about a new setting for them because now they are starting to eat a lot of this uh, food material. Wow, well, look how nice they are. They have grown, huh? They are big now, some are in stage L3 and they are eating like this caterpillar here on the leaves of Prunus Lauro Terrasus. It's time to make a new setting. I have an idea what I can do if you are away for one week or even longer. You can make something like this here that I have prepared. I have a bigger box. I made a hole here for a pot and here is the potted plant of Prunus Lauro Terrasus. What I, do I do with it? I just put it into this hole here, like this, and if I want I can put water here in this box on the bottom so that the plant the roots of the plant are in the water so the caterpillars have something to eat and now I just put my caterpillars into this growing nice Prunus Lauso Terrasus shrub. I think I would put around 20 of them onto this plant here. Do you, do you see that? That's no, probably I'll make it like this so it's better huh, to see it. No lighting it goes in dark but much better. So I just put this plant upside down into this shrub so they can change the plant yeah, and I probably I have two of these plants and two of these plastic cages so I can keep around 20 or so caterpillars on this plant and 20 on the other. And then we will see how long it takes for the caterpillars to eat that whole plant. Also this I put in here so that there are a lot of caterpillars uh, on this plant and the question is what do you think how long it takes them to eat the whole plant and to cover it I just have some velcro tape here around the plastic box and this uh, material against flies or mosquitoes you just have to press it a little bit against the velcro and then the, the cage is closed, but there is a lot of air. And Anterino Suraka is said they love to have a good aeration in their cage. And also this is an easy way to spray the plant and also the insect, because also they like to drink some drops of water, especially in the morning in tropical forests, you find some drops of water of humidity on the plants and they like it you can just spray through this net here to the plant and that's it so and the hole you see is uh, it's made very so that it can close with the pot perfectly so and this is my new setting now for i hope it will last a week so but let's see what happens 